Hello my darlings, so here I have uploaded another recipe So this one is called soy sauce fish, so let's get going! I got here half a kg of uh, red snapper But you can use any fish of your choice So we've basically fried this, um, not exactly deep fry But like semi fry and also got a generous amount of ginger so over here we've got around three inch of ginger so we've cut into such pieces like this so it's better if you guys cut it into these kind of pieces so we've got here a generous amount of uh, bird's eye chili if you don't like it to be too spicy you can definitely reduce the amount of chili I've used over here got a bunch of spring onions so we're gonna cut it like this. This is for garnishing. Oil in a pan. Now we're gonna add ginger to it. So you wait until the ginger turns brown in color. Fry this fish uh, with some seasoning. So I've seasoned it with some turmeric powder and also some salt. So make sure you guys add um, like adjust the salt accordingly so that your dish doesn't turn out to be too salty now that our ginger has changed in color we're gonna now add the chili to it and give it a good mix we're gonna be adding around four tablespoons of light soy sauce what we call ketchup chayer in malay in Malay. So we're going to be adding one cup of water now. So you wait until it boils a little and then you can add your fish. We're adding a little bit of salt to this. So you guys please be mindful when you guys are adding the salt because light soy sauce and dark soy sauce already have salt and we also have seasoned the fish with some salt so we don't want it to be too salty but you can add a pinch or two if you like now that our sauce is boiling we're going to add the fish so we're going to add it one by one make sure your fish doesn't break Someone who's dieting, you can just uh, skip frying the fish before cooking. You can just add your fish as it is to the sauce. Uh, though you can like season it with some salt and turmeric powder, and just add it to the sauce straight away. You don't have to fry it. If you like your fish to be dry, you can just uh, like keep cooking the sauce, and it will just dry out the sauce. But I like it to be really saucy. Because if you eat it with rice, it is really yummy. That's it everybody, our soy sauce fish is done. Now, now I gotta garnish it with some spring onions. They look so beautiful. You guys must try this recipe at home. So that's it everyone, this recipe is really simple. All you need is a couple of ingredients and you can achieve this beautiful, yummy, yummy, yummy soy sauce fish. So I hope you guys can try this recipe at home and I shall see you guys in my next videos. Until then, this is Lady Boss, aka Suganya Praveen. Love you guys, mwah, mwah, mwah. bye! Here I actually